He's like, listen, Roman has gave up a lot of information. Zion, Mikhail, Jackson, Levert the third is who he works for. And it sounds like he has an underground fighting scene. I'm thinking I need to go down there. Now, Don Carter's like, no, 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 wait, 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 wait. So you got this information how? Roman, man, I went in there. He got to singing like a canary. So Kamal is doing detective work. But Don Carter's like, wait a minute. He picks up the basketball. Like, man, I've been hooping for a while. It's either you're a baller or you're not. Where I'm from, you either sell crack or got a wicked jump shot. Or you become a police officer. And that's what I did. Now I'm a detective. When you become the leader of your own task force, you could do things your way. But right now, you're on the Don Carter way. Yeah, I said the Don Carter way. That means I got jurisdiction around the whole state of New York, nigga. I'm that nice, nigga. Every borough is mine. So what we're going to do, Kamal, we're going to try to flip everyone against each other. I'm going to go talk to Monet. I want you to go find that devil child, Tariq St. Patrick. Kamal's like, nah, man. Nah, man, let me go do some investigating. Go down there to the fight scene. See what Zion and them on. Now, he's trying to go down there and try to bet some money. We, 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 we can't trust Kamal just quite yet, even though we can trust Kamal, but we can't trust Kamal if it makes sense. Don said, no, 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 nigga. All that Zion shit sounds good, but I know where I want you to go. We're trying to figure out this quadruple homicide. We're trying to figure out how Tariq St. Patrick is still walking around this city a free man. We're trying to figure out who shot Monet, and I know for a fact it has something to do with that Tejada boy. So Kamal's looking at him like, damn, bro, I thought you brought me in to help out. Don said, nah, nah. You do it my way or it's the highway. Now, me personally hearing something like this and I have an option to hit the highway, I'm hitting the highway. I'm hitting the highway. If you give me an option of doing work or hitting the highway, I'm hitting the highway. Why would I want to put in extra work when y'all ain't paying me no overtime? I'm going to go ahead and hit the highway. Highway for 500, please. So Don Carter tells him, go do your job and I'll do mine. Me and the task force, we got this under control. Now, if you want to continue to work here, then I advise you do what I say. But if you want to go sit behind the desk, then keep talking to me in the old kind of way and think that I won't go to the chief of police myself and tell him to get your ass out of here, Kamal. Plus, you got a dirty brother. I know about your brother, Rashad Tate. He's like, wait a minute, that ain't got nothing to do with me. Yeah, it may not have nothing to do with you, but I can flip it one way or another. So Kamal is forced to go and talk to Tariq. Now, the whole time, Don has that plan in his head. He's like, man, all right, I'm about to go talk to Monet. I'm about to pull up to her bumper. We know Monet is down here spiraling. We already heard what was going on in Monet's head. She don't know who she can trust. She don't know where she can run to. She don't know where she can hide. And Don Carter, when he shows up, his presence is felt. He's in the room. He's sitting there. Monet to hide. Or should I call you Monet Stewart? Or should I call you Mo? <laughs> It doesn't matter about your shooting. I know you had took five shots. Who you think you are, Pac? Well, I just want to give you a heads up that we do have some information on your counterpart of one Tariq St. Patrick. What is your relationship like with Tariq? She's like, uh, I don't have a relationship with Tariq. Said, okay, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Tell me anything. Tell me anything. Well, Tariq St. Patrick fits the description of a of a suspect that was fleeing the scene the day of your shooting. We do have an eyewitness. You know that, right? So it would be best that you get your story. <laughs> you all get your story together because if not, we're coming in and we're going to figure this thing out. Now, Monet, she's trying to act like she ain't surprised. Like, damn, 
there was an eyewitness. When you start getting caught up, you know how it is. You get the lion, you get caught up. But Don, he ain't hesitating. He ain't wasting no time. He's like, just know we're going to stay in touch, Monet. We know about you and Tariq, and there's an eyewitness. So when the information starts to come out, we'll be there. We'll be there. And then he picked up an apple. The disrespect is when he picked up the apple. Look how Monet's looking at him when he picked up that apple. She's like, nigga, ain't nobody offered you one of them apples. Ain't nobody offered you no apple. Don Carter took the apple. We got an eyewitness. Damn, are these Granny Smith apples? This is nice. Where you get these from? The market? Mm. Juicy. Sweet too. Oh, little sour though. Sour apple. Mm. We're gonna be in touch, Monet. Mm -hmm. We're gonna be in touch. You may not know it now, but you're gonna be seeing a lot of me. Mm -hmm. I'm going to take one of these to go, all right? If you need me, here's my card. I gave uh, Miss Jen a card, too. So if y'all want to contact me and tell me whatever you got, I'll be there. It's my landline, my house number. Also, if you ever want to go on a drink, you want to get a drink with me, let me know. We can definitely discuss it. Mm. Got a napkin? Oh, uh, no napkins? Don't worry about it. I got something. I got I got something. I got something better than a napkin, Monet. I got paperwork. I know everything that goes on in the city. I got paperwork. I told you, we keep that paperwork on us. We keep the paperwork on us. There's never a live I don't have the paperwork on me. There's never a live I never had the paperwork on me. We always got the paperwork, Bode. Call me. Call me. So this nigga Don Carter is over here playing everybody. He already told Kamala we're going to have everyone playing against each other. Sometimes we got to lie to get this information. But Monet, she was in the seat like, what the fuck? Because when they start lying to you, you have to wonder what is the truth and what isn't the truth. When they say they got an eyewitness, that eyewitness might be the ring camera. You know what I mean? It may have been, hey, I heard like some shit going down and I was watching it via my ring camera. We already seen what happened with Diana. So an eyewitness could be anybody. You know what I mean? It could be the old man across the street. You think he a creep, but the nigga just old. You know what I mean? He just sits on the porch and just watches. Like he just enjoys life. But you never know, man. He's a witness though. Ely was the, the cousin on Barbershop. Baby girl, I trade it all. That was a good ass song. Now, the last time we see the administrative group, is that it? Yeah. It's Kamal talking to Tariq. Now, we already went over this from Tariq's perspective. Now, Kamal, he's like, listen, Tariq. You fit the description. Now, Tariq wants to know more information. And Kamal's like, look, I can't tell you. And the reason... Kamal says it's an open investigation, so he's not at liberty to tell or discuss any of this. But if this was the case, he wouldn't have told Tariq, hey, you fit the description. Because if Tariq fit the description, then that means you have probable cause to bring him in for questioning. So you guys might be right. Don Carter might be playing Kamal and not actually have an eyewitness.
You see what I'm saying? If if he fit the description, then they could bring him in for questioning. But Kamal's like, well, it's an open case. You know, we can't really discuss it. And then he knows that's Monet. And he's people that Tariq is a little bit smarter than he thought. Because Tariq is like, nah, you probably telling Monet the same thing. And if all of this is true, then you're putting a target on my back. But Kamal's like, man, well, come on down and talk to me so we can, you know what I'm saying, help you out. But I think Kamal's going to start realizing that Don Carter ain't got no information. So he, that's why he was like, man, let me go down to the little fight scene. So maybe there is something up with Don. Maybe Don is on some other shit where he might. I won't say he's not legit, but he just running shit his own way. You know what I mean? His task force, they got jurisdiction over all the boroughs, which is very, very rare unless you're a fed. But even feds have, they don't have jurisdiction. I mean, they're feds, so that means they could, they could move everywhere. But, you know, you still have your little regions and zone that you got to work with it. So what do you guys think? Do you think that there is documentation? I mean, like an eyewitness or anything? Or this is all bullshit. 